So in this Canva video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to add borders around images here on Canva. So um, in this video, I'll be showing you guys two different methods that I know and I use personally uh, to add borders around images here on Canva. Uh, you can use whatever method you want. If you find one easier than the other, by all means, feel free to go do so. Uh, but I will show you guys two different methods, both of which are pretty impactful and pretty effective when adding images or sorry, adding borders to images here on Canva. So first thing you have to do, uh, find an image of your choosing. Uh, for this example, I'm going to go to the elements tab right here. I go to my recently used and use this photo right here of these old fashioned cars. Now, uh, once that is done, I actually want you to stay on the elements tab right here. I uh, go down to where it says lines and shapes and press see all. Uh, since this image is a rectangle slash square shape, I will just use um, the square right here and press on that. So once that is done, I actually just want you to make this square a little bit larger than the image um, that it is showing. So I'm just going to go ahead here and make this image or sorry, make this square just a little bit larger than the actual image itself covering the entire thing. Once that is done, I want you to change the color to whatever color you want to make the background. Um, if you want to make the background right here, um, you want to make a black, which I will for this example, I'm just going to go to solid colors right here and make it black. So um, once that is done, I actually want you to go to where it says position right here. Then I want you to go to uh, position this backwards. So or to the back it doesn't really matter. But for this example, we'll just go position backwards. So I will press on that. Um, so as you can tell, it sort of looks like that there's a black um, background to this. It's not 100% perfect, but if you want to make the uh, the layout as symmetrical as possible, just tap on the image, drag the image to the middle uh, right here, and it'll go ahead and do that just there. And there you go. Uh, that is how you can add a background um, to an image. Now, if you want to make it just group, uh, just highlight both of them, group them together so that if you were to move it, uh, they stay together. If you make it bigger or smaller, it also stays together. That is version number one. Pretty simple, not 100% perfect, not 100% symmetrical, but it will get the job done. Um, that's one way of doing it. Now, the second way where it's actually a little bit more symmetrical, um, in my personal opinion, is I'll just show you guys right now. So go to elements tab right here. I will use the exact same image. So there you go. That's the exact same image. Next thing I want you to do is make sure this image is pressed. Go to the top left corner and press on edit image. Uh, once that is done, I want you to go to where it says shadows. So for me, it says recently used. Um, but if you haven't used it recently, it won't be there. Just scroll down a little bit to where it says shadows right here. Then press on see all. And I want you to press on glow for this example. Um, once you press on it once, I actually want you to press on it one more time to open up the controls right here. So I'll press on it one more time. Uh, where it says size, I want you to drag this bar all the way to the right and make it 40. Uh, transparency, drag it all the way to the right as well, making it 100. Now for blur, if you want to make the, uh, the border a little bit blurry, um, just play around with this bar. If you drag it more to the right, it makes it more blurry. And if you, excuse me, drag it all the way to the left uh, and make it zero, it is less blurry. So as you can tell, there's a pretty thick background right now. Now, if you want to change the size of the background to make it a little bit smaller, kind of like the first example, uh, just drag the bar right here. Uh, if you drag it more to the left, you make it a little bit uh, thinner. If you drag it more to the right, you make it a little bit thicker. Play around with it doesn't really matter. Uh, we'll just use uh, 15, for example. So once that is done, uh, the last thing you have to do is obviously change the color. And as you can tell, it's a lot more symmetrical than this one and a pretty easy way to do it. So um, press on color right here. If you want to make the, uh, you know, the color red, you can make it red. If you want to make a blue, you can make a blue. Uh, I will just stick it uh, with black for now. And then once that is done, I want you to press on apply. And there you go. Uh, if you drag this around, it still follows it. Not a big deal. So um, two different ways you can add um, you know, a border to an image here on Canva. I hope this video helped. Thanks again for watching.